Hello guys, welcome to another video of Nerdy Tech Tips channel. Today we're going to learn how to display a benchmarking while you're playing a game to see the performance of your GPU and your CPU or to show the temperatures just for your YouTube content or you just want you or you're just curious to know what is going on in the background while you're playing your game. So the easiest method to do that is by using an application called MSI Afterburner. Now I would suggest you to download that application from their official website. If you type MSI after burner, all right, this is their official website MSI.com page after burner. Now, if you want to see this kind of information on your screen while you play the game. Um, there is a way once you download this application you can download it from here I would not recommend downloading the beta version I never download beta versions I just download stable versions so I have already downloaded it and installed it so when you first time download and install it will have a different skin and don't forget to uh, tick river tuner while you're installing on the installation screen you will see a river tuner you have to tick that if you do if you haven't ticked that you won't be able to display the benchmarking so your screen might be a bit different because it has different different skins but you gotta look for this settings button and uh, make yourself familiarize with this on-screen uh, GUI so here's a user interface you can change the user interface usually I believe this is the one or I don't know which one actually yeah something like that you would be able to see uh, when you first time download MSI after burner but I like using this one it looks pretty simple so that's why I like to use this one so to be able to display let's say I'm gonna play Call of Duty uh, I've got Call of Duty installed here so I want to display some benchmark marking like uh, CPU usage and frame frame rates per second and something like that and also I want to use I want to see GPU what what's going on with my GPU how much it's been used and what's the temperatures are like so let's click on settings and if you have installed um, river tuner you should be able to see this tab on screen display when you click on it uh, not sorry monitoring not on screen display sorry monitoring that's the one as you can see there are a lot of options here what we're going to uh, do is we're going to go through uh, each and every one whatever you would like to show on the screen um, you need to click on the one let's say I'm going to click on I don't want to select all of these just want the general one let's say GPU core clock I click on it and show an on, on screen so that will show on my screen what else we can choose CPU temp okay well it's already ticked here and let's say what other things we can display frame rate FPS all right uh, show in on-screen display it's already there all right I think that should be enough CPU power CPU clock let's say CPU clock is all already ticked show in on-screen display and we're going to click on apply so I'm going to move this MSI after burn into my other screen and let's play the game
like, hey, I guess I know what I've done wrong here. So, if you guys can hear me, I don't believe there's a lot of background noise. I'm gonna close this game. Okay, that's much better. So, what did I miss? As you can see over here in OSD, means on screen display. None of these have that. So what I was doing wrong is actually clicking and when you actually tick on it and when you see blue here that means you are able to select. You need to make sure it says in OSD. Alright, CPU usage is already there. We can also tick, uh, tick RAM usage. CPU clock. And frame rate. This is the one that we wanted as well. Okay, now we're going to click on apply and press OK. Move this window to the other screen and click hit play. Looks like we're joining in the middle of the fight. Enemy shooting on our air! We've got the hard point! Capture and defend the hard point!
Well, that was not too bad. This is how you display your benchmarking. And I find them a bit annoying and distracting, so I do not like to keep them on. So I'm going to go ahead and turn them off. This, what else was there? This one, CPU clock, and frame rate. All right. So I'm going to go ahead and close it. And thanks for watching this video, guys. Please don't forget to subscribe my channel. Bye now.